Hello and welcome to our series of area guides looking at what it's really like to live in some of Britain's property hotspots. I'm Bryn Lucas and today we're heading to Greenwich, the beautiful area of South East London which is world famous for the Greenwich Meridian Line, chock full of history and a hugely popular place to live for young professionals and families. Now, if you're thinking of moving anywhere, I definitely recommend you grab Phil Spencer's Move IQ Property Report. This is an in-depth look at any individual home you might be considering, and it's especially valuable if you're moving to a new area. It gives you the lowdown on the neighborhood, crime rates, schools, local amenities, planning, and all kinds of useful information besides. You can download yours from the Move IQ website and there's a link below so you can find out more now. And make sure you subscribe to this channel so you can enjoy all our area buying guides and much, much more besides. So why are so many people choosing to relocate to Greenwich? Well, it's both beautiful and only eight miles out of central London, just 20 minutes by public transport. The borough hasn't earned its royal status for nothing. Greenwich was the birthplace of many royal Tudors, including Elizabeth I, and of course it's celebrated for its maritime history. Home to the fantastic National Maritime Museum and the old Royal Naval College, probably its most iconic site is the superbly restored Cutty Sark, the world's only surviving tea clipper. There's also Greenwich Park, part of a World Heritage Site and one of the largest green spaces in this part of London. This is where you'll find the Queen's House, the Royal Observatory, stunning gardens and views of Canary Wharf and the London skyline. And of course, you wouldn't expect house prices to be cheap here. In fact, the average in Greenwich in 2020 stood at almost £680,000, more than double the UK average. Flats average at half a mil and family semis are around 1.1 million. If you're looking to rent, this currently ranges from £260 a week for a studio flat to £560 for a four bed home. The cost of living ain't cheap either because one of the reasons to live here is that there's so much to do. Greenwich Market is stuffed full of street food stalls from across the globe. There are some great gastro pubs and restaurants overlooking the river where the views are as good as the food. The Trafalgar Tavern and Cutty Sark Tavern are just two of the most popular. It's safe to say residents also lucked out when it comes to bars too. There's also some great night spots known for their buzzing atmosphere and great cocktails. But if you do want a night out in the centre of London or you're commuting there, Greenwich is very well connected. Buses are plentiful and the Docklands Light Railway takes you straight to Bank in the heart of the city and the Jubilee Line reaches North Greenwich. Every area has its downsides. So what's not to like in Greenwich? Well, everything that the residents love, the tourists do too. So it's busy in the summer and at weekends. Typical broadband speeds are not as good as the UK average, which is something to factor in if you're working from home. And the crime rate by the end of December 2020 was running at 119 per thousand people. That was down on the previous year, but still high compared to the UK as a whole. But as a resident here, there's so much to love. You'll have the Greenwich Peninsula on the doorstep where artist Damien Hirst grew up and home to the world famous O2 Stadium and the NOW Gallery which hosts modern art installations and exhibitions. The locals love hidden gems like the foot tunnel under the Thames which links the Cutty Sark and the Isle of Dogs. London's only surviving planetarium is at the Royal Observatory, a must for the kids. On a weekend you can browse the bargains at the Clock Tower Market or sample artisan food and drink at the Royal Arsenal Riverside Farmers Market. Explore the unique fan museum, relax and watch the herds of deer in Greenwich Park, or stroll through Oxley's Wood. Greenwich has a great blend of culture and nature. If this has whetted your appetite, do subscribe now because we have more insider's guides to home hotspots coming up. I'll see you next time.